We met Lucero Aguirre in May 2022. She was joined by the scores of parents, teachers, and students at San Juan Bosco RC School in Stan Creek. They visited our studios as part of an outing to Belize City. Aguirre was the president of the school's PTA, and little did we know that this would have been our only encounter with her. Aguirre died on Tuesday after a tragic fall while she was hiking in the Coxcomb Basin Nature Reserve. Aguirre was active in her community, an avid Christian and a supportive parent, and certainly an asset to the school. Vice Principal Delcia Martinez called it an immeasurable loss. Los, as we, we call her, was a very friendly person, always have a smile on her face. Um, her kids were well-disciplined. Uh, she had a supportive husband. The, 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 the community of San Juan is in shock shock waves right now i i don't know what level of comfort we can offer at this time because losing a loved one is hard agira's demise comes just over a week after her 35th birthday and she leaves behind two sons a daughter and her husband omar whom she was hiking with but the community is taking this one hard because agire was sort of a liaison between the largely spanish speaking community and the school admin a lot of parents would go to her because uh, she she speaks very 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 good english so she has that communication with the with she would have the communication with admin so a lot of them would go to her for advice a lot of them would go for her go to her if they need to get something across to us that we are not getting then they would go to her so um and not only that like her kids her kids were were top top, top performers at our school i taught her son last year in San six so he's in first farm now <laughs> And she like she would be there. She would be there. So she would motivate parents, not only motivate, but mobilize them as well. But more than a community worker, organizer and outstanding parent, Lucero spent a lot of time making delicious pastries, which the school often got to enjoy at various functions throughout the year. Martina says that one of the things that they will miss most about Lucero is her willingness to help in almost every situation. It was cultural day that we did, and she had it. It was it was done it with a twist this year that she and the parents they organized, and um, our infant one, even though her son is not in infant one, she was also a part of that cultural day that we were doing for child simulation. So she was always involved. Which, whichever level that I needed her to be, she would have been involved at that level. So I don't know what will happen right now. And I don't know how we're going to um, get past this. Funeral arrangements are now being finalized. For Love News, I'm Dale McDougall.